we're going to read another story. We're going to read One Mitten by Christine O'Connell George. That's the author, the person who wrote the words to the story. And it's illustrated by Maggie Smith. The illustrator is the person who makes the pictures in the book. One Mitten. Hmm, take a look at that mitten. Why do we need mittens? Let's think about that for a second. We wear mittens on our hands and we usually wear them outside when it's cold. Mittens protect our hands from the cold weather. They're perfect in Fort McMurray in our winters because our winters are cold. One mitten. We can see some other winter clothing items here too. I see some hats and a scarf and a glove. Things to keep us warm. One mitten, yellow and bright, fits on my left hand or on my right. Hey, check that out. Her mitten can go on this hand or this hand. I wonder if your mittens can do that too. Can you find your left hand? Here's mine. Let's take a look at the picture. I see a dog and it looks like the dog is curious. The dog wants to see what's going on. And the dog is looking at all these other winter, at all the other winter clothing items. One mitten can wave a mitten hello. One mitten can make a shadow show with shadow shapes of a mitten whale and a slow, slow mitten snail. Oh, look at that, I see some good teamwork. It looks like she's using the mitten to make the body and the head. And look, do you see the little brother's two fingers? They're right here, that's a perfect snail. One mitten is a hat for a rooster's head or a very small mitten bag bed. Ooh, that looks like the perfect sleeping bag for that little stuffed bunny. One mitten is a mitten flag. Hold still, Daisy. Wag, Daisy, wag. Oh, look, they're putting the mitten on the dog's tail. What's the dog's name? Oh, right, it's Daisy, because she said, hold still, Daisy. One mitten gives my sleepy cat a kitchen soft one mitten pat. And under the cat, some yellow fuzz. My other mitten, so that's where it was. Do you ever misplace your mittens? Sometimes it happens in our house where we can only find one. Two mittens can clap, flap mitten wings, make mitten ears, lots of two mitten things. Wow, look at all the silly things, clapping, hiding her eyes. Look, even trying a handstand. Two mittens windshield wipe the frosty glass. It's snowing outside, covering up the grass. Two mittens make binocular eyes. Two mittens wave mitten goodbyes. Then one mitten yellow and bright holds my friend's hand warm and tight. Two friends with mittens were ready to go, skipping mitten warm into the snow. Wow, looks like such a nice day in the snow. The end. Well, that was a cute little story. That story made me want to get my mittens and a flashlight and make some shadow puppets on the wall. That's always so much fun. I wonder what kind of different shadow puppets you could make with some of your winter clothing items. I wonder how a scarf would look or how a hat would look. Anyway, thanks for listening. Bye.